So first clue, bear channel, sell resistance. Second clue, sideways range, sell the highs, right? But then buy a pullback above it. Now what happened today here was, was that we had to get out of this range. Didn't take very long, did it? We broke right through 81.95, and before we could even basically call the trade, it's pull back, pull back, pull back. We made, let's see here, boy, well over 100 ticks before 9 o'clock this morning just on simply seeing some strong price action above the highs of the sideways range. Now we look to sell the highs first, no chance to do that, buy and pullbacks. Then, sure enough, we use that bear channel. We start seeing some exhaustion up here. We start seeing lower highs, lower lows. We start seeing some divergence fire off. And sure enough, we sell it right back down. We make a ton of cash going up. And then short, 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 all the way down. Another 100 ticks on the way down. At this point, we're going, is it really going to be this easy this morning? Lots of volume. It was easy to see those buyers fail at those highs. It really was. We saw it coming a mile away. All we had to do then was wait for price again to hit that resistance up here, and we'll sell it right back down. Now, what happened was, after we, of course, sold the thing back down, we watched, again, pullbacks and up, sold it back down. We watched as price came around and then tumbled again below that 81.95. And remember that sideways range? If I break out, I'm buying a pullback. If I fail and come back down in, you know what I'm doing. I'm looking to sell retracements. So we fail, we come right back down in, and I'm selling retracements on the way down. We spent a couple more times trying to get back above it. It failed and then came back down again. We sold it again. So pretty much the whole entire day today, well, not the whole day, but the bulk of the morning, was spent around this 81.95. And because we knew of the bear channel, because we knew about the sideways range, and because we knew about the resistance levels overhead, we were ready for it. And boy, it didn't take very long for all of us here. It sounded like everybody this morning in the room making their daily goals today. Now remember, 81.95, we marked up this level 7.45 this morning. We knew we wanted to sell those highs first, but if we couldn't sell the highs, if it goes right through, I'm now buying pullbacks. So we buy and pullbacks here, Again, and it didn't give us any chance to sell, just went right through, lots of speed, lots of buyers, easy personality to figure out. By the pullback one, you can see it fails into a 13 range wave long now. Another three, four, and five, right? So once again, we break above 81.95. The speed is cranking higher. The buyers are everywhere. I'm going to begin with the four range chart buying a pullback here one. Make 29 ticks, 833. 836, we come down. I'm going to buy the 13 range wave long. 60 ticks there. And at 837, try to get involved again. I make 8 ticks there. 29 ticks, 60 ticks, 8 ticks. We keep going. We keep going. Higher high. Buying pullbacks. Once again, 838, 19 more ticks. And by this point, we're going, guys, be careful about this thing because we're starting to get up to that overhead resistance we talked about. And we're starting to see things start to stall. Took one more trip, one more swing here, 20 ticks at 841, and this is when we start seeing lower highs, lower lows. We're getting divergence firing off on faster time frames. It was extremely easy, if you recall. I'm screaming, guys, they're failing. We're slowing down. Momentum is overbought already. All we need now is mark up that swing low, and of course, we get the swing low. Now, Momentum was oversold at that time, so we waited for chop around a little bit. Momentum finally confirmed. Bam! Right there's my short, 44 ticks now selling off the highs. We're going to keep going. My target, of course, here is this support, the 81.95. So we break a new lower low. I'm going to keep going short here. If we keep dropping another one here, 75 ticks at nine o'clock.